My name is Rabbi Yisrael Bernath. In November of 2008, we came to NDG to bring a little spirituality, a little bit of Judaism. Chabad House and NDG has brought the Jewish feeling in the area that wasn't there before. This area didn't have anything. There was no sense of community. It's just brought the community together. Monkland is a bit of a hangout. You're finished work, you're finished school, whatever it is, you want to get around, grab a cup of coffee, you'll come to Monkland. But what's nice is that this has really added a whole new dimension. There was really no open Jewish presence here before. And a lot of young Jews were moving into the area, a lot of students, young professionals, and we felt that we needed to go to their turf. We have the local NDG community and we work with Concordia. And when we got there, you know, we had some resistance. We came and we brought our, our beards, <laughs> and we brought some pizza. We got together and we've done unbelievable things. I didn't know like any Jews, and then like Yoni comes up to me in the library, and I have no idea who he is. I see him with like a beard and a kifa. It made me like excited, you know, to see like, it's actually like a Jewish community growing there. Chabad for me is a place where I can get some, some spiritual nourishment. That's something that I feel I lack in my life very much. And Chabad is the first place where I went to for that, and I actually found it, which was a really nice surprise. We sort of built a bit of a, of a community, a bit of a following. It really exploded. We had large parties, we had large-scale uh, events, and I believe that there are a lot of really passionate people that are, that are working really hard to keep that in a, in a sort of upward rise. I want young Jews to feel proud to be Jewish. There's nothing to hide. What I love is that there's all types of events, from a big Chabad pouring party to uh, small little events where we're having hot dogs outside as a barbecue. It's just a whole big fun experience and every event feels new, different, uh, something special. You can come into Chabad NDG on a Shabbos morning and feel that it's a very intimate experience and yet there can be 50, 60 people. And there's always events going on. I mean, I can't even fit it all into my schedule. There's so much stuff going on. It's wonderful. Every week that I come to Shul, I just feel more inspired and I feel like more part of the community than I did the week before. Every Wednesday, Rabbi Bernath has these relationship classes. But I really wouldn't call them relationship classes. I would call them more life classes. <laughs> he really reaches out and talks about every issue that a young adult would face in the world. For me, the connection with Yisrael was the most important part. The fact that I liked him and could identify with him and with his attitude and style. There was no force, there was no dictation, there was no this is right, this is wrong. And he respected my, my questioning. That is something that I find extremely rare. I met my husband here at Chabad. I met my Beshert here. To me, that is uh, something that I'll be forever grateful. I was here and my fiance was traveling back and forth and we decided, you know, this would be a really great community to get, to get married in. I met Rabbi Israel. We talked and uh, he explained to me in order to find my Beshert, I have to be connected to Hashem and show that I'm serious about getting married. So. I uh, started investing myself more. The first month I started doing it, I uh, met Jan at the Chabad. I was far away the community, and then someone told me to go to the Chabad NGG. Then uh, I met uh, Anna. There was nothing for me here. You know, I didn't know anybody in Montreal. And um, when I came here, you know, it became my family. For my husband and I, it's given us a place to feel connected to and to feel that we have a place to turn when we have questions that need to be answered. It was really great that we had people to turn to, um, like Rabbi Bernath and his wife Sara. Um, really, really great people. Chabad has been a big part of our uh, coming togetherness. What Chabad does is it bridges that gap between the physical world 
and the spiritual world. I want to go beyond the everyday of, you know, my everyday of life. I really want to have uh, something more, something deeper. Friendships are being created, relationships are being created. It's, it's a family, it's a community that wasn't in existence before. And I think that it's only going to get bigger and bigger. Everybody brings something different to the table. And Rabbi Bernath really has a way of connecting everyone together and bringing everyone in. As a spiritual person, you constantly have to have a source that you can go to to be fed. I feel, you know, again, Harvard Corner Monklin is that source for me. Chabad NDG means being able to grow in an environment where they feel like their growth belongs to them. One of the most wonderful things is the community's developing. The sense is that we're all developing together in our own very different ways. I believe that in five years uh, the Jewish community can be exponentially stronger than they are now, exponentially more visible. Our Jewish students will uh, feel a lot of pride and belonging coming to Concordia. I can only see it getting bigger and better and as you can see the space keeps on filling up and we need more and more of it.